Hello, this is just a quick video featuring Barbara from the Historical Society at Lightning Ridge talking a little bit about botany, specifically about this stuff, which is saltbush, which has an unusual survival mechanism. The saltbush is very fresh and green, and of course the animals love it in times of drought. But they'll eat it any time, and you know we can eat it on our salad. Salt? It's palatable. Some is saltier than others. Some has a metallic taste, but by gum, that's pretty good. There are 34 varieties of saltbush. And from little tiny ruby saltbush to the larger leafed ones, you can see this is even starting going to seed. And as you glimpse the bush, you notice there are leaves that are more yellow than others. They're called sacrifice leaves. And this is mother nature at her best. The water is drawn up through the soil and the salt is sent to the sacrifice leaves so that the rest of the plant is using the, the good water that's going to make it grow. Sacrifice leaves, you wouldn't want to bother to eat them because they would be too salty. But generally, salt bush has been a wonderful regenerator. It's a great plant for uh, out in this country where we often have drought and such a lack of water. This video was made with the help of the Lightning Ridge Historical Society. If you enjoyed it, please consider sharing it with your friends and maybe subscribing to IDU Curiosity on YouTube. You can also follow along on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram if that's your thing. Thank you for watching.